Learning how to script is not hard at all. Especially with these five simple hacks that can help anyone with scripting. Starting off with number one, use flowcharts to visualize your scripts. You see, most developers want to make complex scripts, but they get stuck halfway through due to lack of problem solving skills or lack of planning in general. That's why flowcharts are so great. A flowchart is a diagram that depicts a process, system, or computer algorithm. In this scenario, we're using it to depict a function. Here's how you're going to plan your next script with your own flowchart, alright? You're going to start with a start and an end point. Then, fill in the flow of how you want your script to run. I usually like to make my own flowcharts on a piece of paper, but you can find digital flowchart makers as well. Now I'm just getting started here guys. I've still got 4 more tips to make you better at scripting. Let's continue. Number 2. I want you to make mistakes in order to make progress. Developers hesitate to experiment with scripting or maybe to take that commission because they're afraid of making mistakes. Well, let me tell you, fear of failure paralyzes progress. Every professional scripter has made dozens if not hundreds of mistakes already. The only difference between you and them is how you handle those mistakes. Number 3. I want you to take more breaks in order to stay focused. Constantly working can eventually lead to burnout and increased stress levels. In order to make sure you don't experience either of these, make sure to take at least one short break every day, especially while learning or studying. For me, this is an absolute game changer when it comes to scripting as it allows you to refresh your mind and stay focused on your work and your goals. Now so far, I've shown you how to create flowcharts to stay organized and to visualize your scripts how to handle the mistakes you make in order to learn from them and progress, and even shared why you should take short breaks to refresh your mind and decrease burnout. At this point, these tips will already have changed how you script, but I've still got two more to show you, so let's continue once again. 4. Have patience in order to learn. Look, most things worth anything often take time. Yes, it may take a month or two of studying to learn scripting. Yes, it may take a few months to create an actual game. But these things take a lot of time for a reason. If you rush making a game or even rush to learn as fast as possible, you're not going to retain what you're learning and your game is going to be pretty sloppy. So let me remind you, the man who loves walking will always walk farther than the man who loves the destination. This means that the man who spends his time learning and not rushing will always make more progress in the long run than the man who rushed. Which ultimately brings me to number 5. I want you to stop watching tutorials to learn faster. We all get better at whatever we do by actually doing it ourselves. Teachers can only teach you so much, and at some point you have to start practicing and develop your own talent inside of scripting. After all, practice makes perfect. For ways to practice, you can watch this video here or you can watch this video to find out how you can teach yourself scripting.